Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I want to talk about a very important topic for protecting your lens. And it's actually something really simple and it has to do with UV filters. And in this video, I want to talk about the pros and cons of UV filters and why I got a UV filter myself. And I also want to tell you from a little backstory when I didn't use the UV filter. And yeah, to begin this video, when I started out with photography, I got the 30mm 1.4 from Sigma and this was my first lens and I got it because I wanted to do a lot of portrait photography and after a half a year of shooting without the UV filter, I also got a lot of dust onto my lens. And yeah, dust isn't the best thing on your lens because it can scratch your lens and when you clean off your lens a lot of times, yeah, you can like maybe make micro scratches, if you know what I mean, and you don't want that to happen. After half a year, I got my new lens, the 85mm 1.8 from Sony, and I was so confident that I also should get a UV filter because I don't want my 500 euro lens to get like scratches. So I got my first UV filter online and I paid like 10 or 15 euros and I put it onto my lens and when I started doing my first photos, I didn't really see a big difference. And to start off with the pros, UV filters are very cheap. And when you put them onto your lens, they help you to get rid of UV light. And of course, they help you to prevent scratches and dust going onto your lens. And that's so important because you don't want scratches onto your lens because they might actually uh, turn your images differently. For example, when you do a photo, and if you have scratches on your lens, you can also see that on the image. And lenses are so expensive today and you don't want to like have like a minor scratch which can ruin your whole photo shoot. And that's why I got a UV filter myself because I didn't want that to happen. But of course, there are also some disadvantages of a UV filter. And I honestly feel uh, I don't see a big difference. But when you go closer and look at an image, there's like a one or two percent slightly difference. For example, at the end of the day, a UV filter is still a novel glass on your lens. And yeah, it's not the most expensive glass you get. It's a cheap glass when you go for a cheap UV filter. And yeah, it's, it can make some differences in the image. I personally didn't see a huge difference. Um, the sharpness was still there and overall my clients and the models I work with were still happy with the pictures and honestly I still shoot with a UV filter today uh, because I don't see a big difference but there are some slightly differences and this is something you have to bear in mind when you get a UV filter but honestly I wouldn't worry about it too much you still have great pictures and yeah you kind of guess now now we go to the conclusion of this video so I personally will use UV filters in the future and I will continue using them. And photography is also a long-term thing. You still want to use the lenses in five years, six years. So that's why I still use a UV filter today and I haven't regretted at all. I actually really love uh, filming with a UV filter. What I'm doing right now, I'm actually having a UV filter on my camera now. And on my photo shoots, I always use a UV filter. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I was able to help you with this video. And yeah, more content will come soon. And you can of course subscribe to my YouTube channel so you're updated when I upload a new video. You of course can also press on the notification bell and of course ring it so you're updated always. And of course you can also follow me on Instagram to see my portrait work. And on my Instagram you also see pictures with a UV filter. All my portraits are with a UV filter, so you can also check my work there. And guys, always take care of yourself and see you next time. Bye.